Today we're checking out another Darman movie. Genius Boy is excluded from a party, man. Don't exclude people from parties. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and I hope you enjoy. Bro, you going to Blake's birthday party tomorrow night? Yeah, it's gonna be so fun. It's gonna be great, man. Blake's hey, Alex. Halloween party. You dropped this. Thank you. Can you tell Jaden we're excited to see him at the party? I will. <laughs> hey, Mom. Hey, sweetie. Have a good day? Yeah. Hey, Mom. Hey, honey. How was school? Okay. Alex said he's excited to see you at Blake's party. Oh. Um, but you didn't invite him? I, I didn't get invited. You didn't? Brenda! Oh, fuck. Oh, hi, Kathy. She's gonna hi, call her out. Good. Um, I know it's Blake's party tomorrow night, and um, I was wondering, uh, Jaden said he didn't get invited. Since they're friends, I figured it was just a mistake. Oh, no. No mistake. Whoa, even Jayden the mom's on to this? But it was great seeing you, Kathy. Have a great day. Brian, hey. I'm having a party. Did you hear it? What kind of mother is that sick to say no? Fuck, bro. What's she going to tell her son? There you go. <coughs> Thanks, Mom. I made your favorite. You know, I was thinking, since Halloween is coming up, maybe you'd want to go to... Universal Studios Horror Nights. I bet Mikey and Jay would want to go too. Mm. That could be fun. No thanks. I always feel like the third wheel of them. Well, we could invite Noah too. He's more of their friend too. Well, are there any of your friends you'd like to invite? He doesn't have many well, friends, it's I just see. The two of us. We would still have fun. I don't want to go to that. <sighs> Oh, okay. Um, well, I know you like horror movies, so we could go see Five Nights at Freddy's or- Ooh, that's gonna be cool. I don't want to do anything this weekend. Actually, I'm not really hungry. Is it okay if I finish my homework in my room? Honey, does this have anything to do with Blake's party? Is there something that happened between the two of you that I don't know about? He just doesn't like him, I guess. Don't know. <clears throat> He's nice at school. Just never wants to hang out with me after school anymore. Right? When I started feeling like I had a friend, I, I, I don't know why no one ever wants to hang out with me. Sweetheart, a, a lot of people want to hang out with you. Yeah? Like who? That's it's, not uh, family. You have to find friends. those people. Can I just please go into my room? Yeah. Oh, this sucks, man. Nah, bro, that's gonna be that's gonna be too much, bro. Like you're gonna come off so desperate. Like, why go to a party that no one wants you to be at? Hey Kathy. Love the whiskers. <laughs> See you and Jaden tonight at Brenda's? Um, actually, we're not going, but have fun. Oh. That's She's too like, bad. Why are you not going? Are you guys going out of town, or...? Unfortunately, Jaden wasn't invited. Mm. I'm sorry. Are you guys going to do anything else? You know, I asked him if he wanted to go to Universal Studios Horror Nights. He normally likes that, but he said no. Maybe you could try a movie night. With a tent and everything. Kids love that. Oh, hey, are you, uh, are you guys going to the party tonight? Jaden wasn't invited. Huh. But I, I thought uh, Blake and Jaden were friends. Mm. Right? He thinks he's not good enough for the party. How cute is this Minecraft pinata that I found? I specifically told you that Blake was into Roblox. Not Minecraft. Oh, uh, I'm oh. so sorry. Let me see what I can do. What's her problem? Roar! <gasps> How cute is this? I can never scare you. It's okay, honey. Are you getting excited about your party? 
It's all coming together. Mom, can I ask you something? Mm-hmm. Is Jaden coming? He wants Jaden um, to come? No, baby, he's not. Why uh, doesn't she want I him to come, man? his mom, but she declined, and I don't think he really wants to come, honey. But it's oh, okay. That sucks, man. You should just forget about him, all right? You have a lot of friends coming, and you're going to have a great time. Okay? I promise. What a bad mother, uh, man. Have fun. Okay, we are all set for the Roblox pinata. And for dinner, you said 25 people, right? Okay, let me check the RSVPs. Well, that's odd. Two people just changed their status. I guess yeah, it's because... It. Oh, well, that's typical. They're assholes. Usually 10% of people who RSVP end up not coming. I wouldn't worry. Oh. Make that three. It's because they found out that's about that fine. discrimination. I will make an order for 22 then. And again, it's gonna drop again. I can just sense it dropping. Oh, hey, Kathy. Getting a last minute birthday present? <laughs> Me too, <I'm> guilty. <laughs> oh, um, no, Jaden and I are just gonna have movie night in the backyard. So I'm picking up some treats. No, I'm sorry. I, I figured you were going to Brenda's. You know, consider how close that Blake and Jaden are. Were? Not so much anymore. Oh, sorry to hear that. You know, I remember being that age and kids have all kind of fallen outs. I wouldn't worry. Well, that's just it. I asked Jaden and he doesn't think it has anything to do with the boys. I think it has to do with Brenda personally, but I don't know what. I just, I wish she would have said something to me because she has no idea how much this has really affected Jaden. You see, Jaden has always been a great kid, but for whatever reason, he just hasn't been good at making friends. That's why he was so excited when Blake transferred in. From the moment they met, it was clear they were gonna be inseparable. All he wanted to do was be hanging out all of the time. And Brenda seemed perfectly fine with it. Until she found they out. At school, after school. And they even competed in competitions together. Knowing how much Jaden struggled with making friends, nothing made me happier than watching the two of them together. And that's why it's been so hard seeing Brenda suddenly keeping Blake away from Jaden. Bro, what a whack ass Sorry mom. So why would she do that? Just, they're just kids, you know? They don't deserve this. Well, it's unfortunate. Just the boy's relationship to be ruined for no apparent reason. Uh, gosh, it makes me, makes me wonder if I should even go. No. No, you should go and, and have fun. We'll be fine. We're gonna read Goosebumps and watch Wednesday reruns. Just tell Jamie we said hi. No, I, I will. <laughs> Not to be a party oh. pooper, but Blake already has that one. What if he says I something? So, uh, it must be kind of hard for anybody to buy him a gift at this point. I mean, he has everything. <laughs> well, I was just putting it back. Oh. Well, did you get a chance to see the Evite? Because there's a gift registry on there, so it's probably a lot easier. You know, something came up. What the fuck? Fortunately, so Jamie and I are not going to be able She's to... She's honey for gifts, bro. Tell Blake I, I did say happy birthday. Uh, wait, Brian? That was strange. Hey, happy Halloween. Oh, thank you. I really... Oh, I get it. You're the reason why everybody's canceling. Excuse me? Three people canceled last minute, and now Brian makes four. 
He literally had a present in his hand for Blake, and then he put it back. So that's I wonder, all she cares what about, or who changed his mind? If you're trying to suggest that I had anything, oh, I'm I... not trying to suggest anything, Kathy. It's clear you are telling people not to come to Blake's birthday party, and that's so petty of you. Just because you didn't get an invite, Brenda, I will have you know I did no such thing. I did not tell anyone not to come to the party. Brian told me that he felt bad that Jaden and I weren't going, but I told him to go anyway. I don't try to stop people from hanging out together, unlike you. And what is that supposed to mean? Oh. You know what, Kathy? If you were in my shoes, you would do the exact same thing. Exact same thing. How? At some how? point, are you going to tell me what actually happened? Because as far as I know, our kids still want to be friends. So if I did something that offended you, I am sorry. Oh my gosh! Try not to act so innocent. You know exactly why. No, I don't. Oh, okay, well then let me spell it out for you. This has nothing to do with you, and everything to do with your son. Because you have autism. You see. She doesn't I want him to act like him. I was pretty happy to see Blake like making new friends so quickly, but I couldn't help but notice Jaden was always being extra competitive with him. It's like everything my son did, Jaden somehow tried to do it better. Oh, but he's not gonna. He's gonna grow see that in way. My son's eyes that he was hurt, even if he didn't say anything about it. Well, he needs to learn that. The academic bowl was the last straw for me. After I saw how much attention Jaden was getting, and not Blake, I knew I could no longer let our boys hang out together. Well, that's not gonna stop him from being more successful. So you see, I am not going to let Jaden overshadow Blake and belittle him anymore. You know, Blake is gonna become Especially better if he starts hanging out with Jaden because he's gonna learn his techniques and I shit. I just wish you would have said something sooner. I promise you, Jaden would never do anything to purposely hurt Blake. Blake is just a child. He didn't see what was happening, but I did. Okay. That is Jaden why I'm is just not a child to too. Your son hang out with my son any longer. I know parents can have their differences, but unless there's like a really extreme reason, a parent's differences should not stop kids from being able to be friends. It is not fair to them. You are not listening to me. Jaden is constantly beating Blake at everything. And making him feel bad about himself. Well, that sucks because there's always someone going to be better it, than you. It will affect him one day. So I am putting a stop to this. Now, if you'll excuse me, this is the party planner, and I have to take it. Guests will be arriving. You know what, Kathy? It feels good that Blake is finally better at something than Jaden. And that's how what? Friends. Take care. How could she say that to someone? Hey, Bridget, how's the party coming? <sighs> Wonderful. Yo, look at the tail she and had. One more from your father. That looks seductive, bro. Blake, Kenny, would you like to open up one of these now? No, thank you. I'll just wait until the guests arrive. Okay, sweetie. All right, we are all set. Are people still arriving at eight? Well, that's what I put on the invitation. Oh. Oh, well, I wouldn't worry. People are always notoriously late to parties. I'm sure they'll come soon. I don't think anyone's gonna show up. Do you wanna watch Wednesday first or read a book? Hmm. You can decide. How about some candy? Let's see, we've got Skittles, Starburst, M&M's, Twix. I'm okay. Thanks, Mom. Okay. Yeah, he really, he really well, feels that bad if about it. If you don't want to do this, we could play video games. Mom, you don't even know how to play. I could learn. All right, well, just tell me, what do you want to do? You can pick anything. Hold that thought. It's 
gonna be her. Oh, what the hell? What are you guys doing here? Brian told us about your conversation at the store. That's why we and lots of others decided not to go to Blake's party and to come here instead. Is that okay? It's, it's not a bir oh, it's not we, a birthday party. Yeah. Come on in. This doesn't make sense. Everyone should be here by now. Well, maybe they're stuck in traffic because of all Nah, bro. They it's don't. They don't want to go to your dookie ass party. Are you party. trying to tell me that every single person is over an hour late? Well, did you double check the dates on the invite? Yes. Here, check the evite. There's probably zero people wanting to attend. Um. This can't be. It looks like everyone went to Jane's party. What? Here, let me see that. Ooh. Give me my phone, woman. Yo, Thank you so this much is for crazy. coming, guys. I'm really, I haven't seen Jade in this happy in a long time. Give me a sec. I Brent, why does this. she have her number? This is stupid, bro. Oh, hi, Brenda. What a nice surprise. Oh, cut the crap, Kathy. I know you told people not to come to Blake's birthday party. No one is here. I did not. For your information, I was just as surprised to see them all here as you are. I guess when they found out that Jaden wasn't invited, they decided to come on their own. Kathy, please. Just tell everybody to come on over. You and Jaden are invited. You have no idea what this is doing to Blake. Well, oh, I'm sorry, but I have plans now. And maybe now you can understand how you made my son feel. Uh, what's that? Oh, oh, there's more people coming? Damn. Okay. I, I now look go. whose son has be more I guess friends. I Blake doesn't have more friends than Jaden after all. Bye, Brenda. Kathy, wait, 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 wait. Why is Jane, he mad? How long have you been standing there? <laughs> Why is he mad, bro? At this point, do you want us to start cleaning up? Or maybe we can cut the cake. Blake, would you like to see the Roblox cake I bought you? Bridget and I can sing you a happy birthday. No. I think I'm just gonna go to bed. Oh, sweetie. You can't go to sleep without cake. Why don't you at least blow out your candles? Blakey? Yo, he's, he's trying to take a long ass nap. I heard there's a birthday party. Where's the birthday boy? <laughs> oh, right here. <laughs> nice, nice costume! costume. <laughs> uh, let's go push your fun. Yeah. Hi. Damn. I mean, she didn't. She didn't do that for Brenda. She did that for the son. Hi. <laughs> <Back. laughs> Thank you for making this happen. I didn't think you were gonna come. No, I wasn't going to. But then Jaden reminded me that just because parents have their differences, that shouldn't stop their kids from being able to be friends. I agree. I hope you learned so, a valuable lesson in. there, Brenda. Got some fabulous cheese dip. <laughs> okay, it looks like she finally learned her lesson. But that is genius, Jaden. Boy, is genius boy is kicked out from party. Well, at the end, it all worked out, man. But yo, just because someone is better than you doesn't mean the next guy is not going to be better than you. There's always someone going to be better than you unless you're that one person who's like at the top. So like it shouldn't even bother you because like there are people better and worse than you and you got to get used to it because that's life, bro. Like 
As soon as he fucking steps out into the real world and there's like people who are like 10 times better than Jaden, he's gonna, his, it's gonna destroy his psyche a lot, man. But that is the video, man. Let me know what your thoughts are. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.